hello everybody and welcome back to my channel this is the same age with Lisa in 2021 years my very very first video for the channel for the year cheers to that anyway guys i know that i haven't been uploading in a long time but i'm sorry guys i'm really sorry i am going to be uploading this year i pray to the gods of youtube and the ancestors of youtube to please guide me in this thing called uploading and consistency because girl go hard go hard for me guys like <laughs> i ain't having it oh the sun is just kissing me today yeah do you see me though do you guys see me like should i pose hmm do you guys see me? <laughs> As you've seen with the title of the video today, I am telling you what I got up to. Okay, one of the things that I got up to this December, which was, guys, I went to Durban, KZN, for the very first time. And I went to see the ocean for the very first in my whole entire 24 years of life. I had never seen the ocean until this. I went to Durban with my friend Rose. Um, it was nice. So we, we took a bus. Okay, the first thing, I didn't want to take a bus. But my friend is scared of taxis and quantums. So now I wanted to take a taxi because I know taxis were just gonna get there. Because I'll be 120 and then I'll be away. But, okay, my friend was like, oh! And I was like, oh, okay. So we took a bus to Durban. It was nice. So I had to write things down because, yeah, a lot took place there. Anyway, we got there. Immediately, we got there at around like 7 to 8 to 9. I'm not sure. I forgot. But we got there really late, like at night. And we get out of the bus, guys, in Devon. Yo! The moist in the air, guys. The moist in the air is... I love hot weather. Like, since it's summer, I, I don't think I've ever complained so far. Because I just like the summer. I like the hotness. I want to be hot. Okay? So I hate winter. But so say. So we get there to the place when we arrive at water at blue water hotels blue waters hotel guys i get there ready to check in hey the lady's like yes listen you are almost welcome i'm like yes me and my friend right she's like no you put for the city alone and i'm like lady i am with my friend here and she's like yes you are with your friend but you book for yourself alone and i'm like what and she's like yes so immediately we get there when we have to pay and i'm like this is the thing about me i don't like paying i don't like taking out money i don't like spending money you know but what has to happen has to happen like we needed to pay so that we can go check in so we checked in everything is cool we get to the room and the room is is all right i've seen better it's all right anyway but it's at the beach front like it's at the we we at the beach front like we have the balconies we get the views the views were spectacular guys there was but hey anyway we get there we settle in we start drink again the juice okay we drink the juice the cold drinks and when you get there we can eat we sit around three around two like friend we need to sleep okay shall we sleep early in the morning guys check what happens in the morning hey! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, oh my god! Early in the morning, 
We ain't looking cute, but the views are making the best. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. We get up at around 6. We go to the beach because the first thing that we want to do is to see the beach. We like, the beach, here we come. Oh, here we have arrived at the beach. The bitches get to the beach and they're like, ah! it was so nice, guys. Please look at this video. Like, us feeling the sand for the very first time. Like, look at this video. served up until 10 so now we needed to leave because we got there around 7 now we needed to leave and go to the hotel and eat and come back to the beach so that's what we did we went to the hotel ate our breakfast and went back to the beach and then we spent almost the whole day guys at the beach we spent a long like we left the beach around 2 3 we had got there like around the second time after breakfast we got there at around like yo i'm sure around 11 we were there the whole entire day and we were so happy like we were fulfilled we were happy the home we change and then we go around like the beachfront like there's paving all over and people are walking walking their dogs i saw a I saw a monkey that has blue balls. I didn't know there's such. I didn't know. A monkey can have like blue balls. I don't know why. Like the color of the balls, the bollocks of the monkey were blue. Literally sky blue. Like it's not even like, I'm not even exaggerating. But Rose was like, yeah, it's normal. And I was like, what's normal? My boyfriend was just like, it's normal. I'm like, I don't know. I still don't know. I still don't know. Anyway, we go to the restaurants around the beach, like in front in front of the beach there. And then we saw every like every um we saw every every restaurant that we knew. Like we wanted something we couldn't find in Jewelry. You know, because for me there's really no point of being at a foreign place. And then still doing the same things that you do when you're at your own place like it doesn't make sense to me when I've traveled so what I always want to do is try new things like new food new something it's just that I can't really eat hot water hot water hey hot spicy food I can't eat that so anyway so from there we actually find a restaurant called Jokul's it's a vibe there's music like that place has a vibe of new news cafe like type of thing so we get there we eat we eat with the views guys you are eating here and the, the beach is right there you're looking at the waves i'm like yeah this is the life most this is this is what i want to do breakfast name nice and easy we eat nice breakfast we take a lot of pictures look at the pictures that we took for breakfast
Then we go to the beach. Now we we taking our guns out now, and we are gonna spill this thing called the beach again. We stayed at the beach, guys. We got there at around nine at the beach. We left at one, guys. Like for me, the beach was the the most important thing I could do in Devon. Like nothing mattered. Like I felt like everything else that was in Devon, I could get it anywhere in Joburg but the beach so i was like the focal thing is the beach i'm just gonna go to the beach okay we went to the beach we played we went to ikagasi lasika gasa kwala monandi kwala lit and then from there we went to ushagamari Onto something different. Onto something nice. I mean it. It's been great. It's been fun. We've been looking good. Oh my. Ushaga Marine. Ushaga Marine for me, it was nice, but it was like okay. Like I thought it was gonna be wow, like the beach. But for me, it was like, like it gave me the feels of um, what's that place? Gold Reef City, you know. Except for the waterness, that the theme that is water. Like I feel like. Gold, gold, gold Reef City. The theme there is those adventurous and adrenaline things. That's that's the that's the theme. And then for Ushaga Marine, the theme is water. So for me, it was like, oh okay. But then we saw nice things. We saw the sh we didn't see the sharks. Did we see those sharks? Dolphins. We saw those. We saw a lot of things like what you see at Ushaga Marine. And then the the most nice thing for me was the bicycles we went on those ride along the beach with bicycles but not the two-wheel bicycles we went on four wheels because i was like hey the last time i was on a bicycle was literally oh more than whoa was around when i 2007 six that was when i was on a bicycle that's a lie i was on a bicycle when i was at uj second year so Last time I was on a bicycle, I was in, it was in 2017. And then I go to Devon, where I am not even a resident. In a whole total new environment. And I go there and I think I'm going to just ride a bicycle. No, I was like, you know, I grow, stick to your roots, stick to your reality. You don't know how to ride a bicycle. You need a press. I know how to ride a, a bicycle, but I need practice. So I was like. She ain't doing that. She ain't doing that. And then I didn't ride a bicycle. I only ride, rode a, a four-wheel bicycle. You know? It was nice. Like...
Okay, hi. Initially, reverse parking, hi. Oh, hi. Two jokers because that's where they were. So I went there. It was so nice. From there, guys. Hey! The night was young. And the night was very much young. The night, guys, was so young. I mean, we got there, it was nice and nice and nice. Now, we went, I was like, okay. They were like, oh, they said you're from like, De like you're from Joburg. And I was like, yeah. They're like, where have you been? Like, what, what clubs have you been to? And I'm like, none. And they're like, what? You need to go. It's like you need to go to One X or you need to go. What's the other restaurant? Not the restaurant. What's the other pub? One mix or. I needed to go to either Ayatin or Guamex. So my cousin was like, no, let's go Guamex. I was like, anywhere we go, anywhere we go. And we went to Guamex, guys. Hey! Yeah, guys, Guamex was so lit. It was so lit. It was so lit, guys. I want a Corona. 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 Because now we needed to leave at like quarter to 12. And the DJ was like, oh. I'm like, oh, what guys, we just got here. And the DJ was like, ah. I'm like, oh, what DJ? And the DJ was like, so we needed to make our way out. <gasps> Excuse me. But guys, it was so late. Like, comics is nice. It's like, <gasps> for me, it also starts with, like, the way comics is. Like, it, it's beautiful. Like, the building is nice, guys. Like, ho ho thing. And then there's, there was enough space. We were on the ground floor. Obviously, we got there late. We were on the ground floor. There was still space for people to like move around. Like it was nice. I like the fact that it was open area, especially now that there's COVID. It's it's important to be where there is ventilation, you know. But it was so nice, guys. Like yo, I think look at the pictures. Lit at that time. I was lit. And then we were at this other place. We went. I was aware that we were going somewhere still. But I don't know where it was. I didn't even ask. I was just like, off we go. We go, we go. We then we went to this other place. It really it really didn't look nice. I don't even know what the place is. But I'm not proud for this one that I made it there. But I'm gonna be honest and show you where I went. Yeah. The place like when you arrive at a function that you are not invited to, and then you become the VIP of that function. It's when you know when you are out of your own. But okay. we were there to have fun, and we did. We so did. We had so much fun. We left that place at around to two to three. I don't know. I don't know. But all I know is that when I got to my place that day, Ilanga be pumi. The sun was out. And I was, I was supposed to come back with my friend. 
But now that my friend was at home, she was able to book a tech a, a bus coming from, and then her bus was at around half past eight, and she told me that over the, uh, like while I was still Guamex, while it was still lit lit. And she's like, friend, I'm booking a bus and the one that I'm finding is for half past eight tomorrow. And I was like, friend, do you know that girl is far away from you right now? And girl is having a lot of alcohol. There's a lot of alcohol in my body right now. I will not be able to wake up early in the morning before half past eight and make it to Hauke and make it to that bus. So girl, book for yourself. I'm gonna take a taxi. Like I'm I'm cool. I was like, I'm not even gonna stress about this. I'm not even gonna stress. It's fine. Like girl, go. It's okay, you know? And my friend booked. So at that time when I arrived, she was like, I was like, sorry to wake you up because I knew that she was gonna wake up anytime from then. I thought it actually I thought I was gonna find her preparing to leave. But she was still sleeping, so I was like, Oh, I'm sorry to wake you up. And then I got there. I died. Woke up around half past seven because she was, you know, when for me, I am not a deep sleeper. So when someone is around and moving around, I can't really sleep. So when she was packing, fixing herself up, ready to go, I woke up and I was up the whole entire time from there. And what I did was when she left, after she left, I was sitting in my bed and thinking, well, Am I waking up? Well, like I was trying to plan out my day, and then from there, I just took a shower, went to the beach, collected some sea water or ocean water because everyone was collecting the water. So I was like, you know what, let me just go to the sea and just collect water. Um, be at the beach for like a few minutes. Like, look at this. To the to the hotel got ready packed my bags everything because i was supposed to check out at 10 was it 10 or 11 or 9 i was supposed to check out at 10 so what i did was go to the hotel pack everything make sure i'm not leaving anything and then i went downstairs to get um breakfast but when i got there it was so full and i was supposed to wait for some time and i think it was around half nine already by that time so i was like no let me just check out and just leave so i went and checked out and yeah while well, i was still checking out there were people who were still like around there who were checking in and i was like oh, how i wish i was there guys to check in with you guys because i'm not ready to go to direct to jordan but anyway guys so i went i called my uber and then i left went to the taxis got in a taxi and i came back to Joburg. so that is my trip to david it was so spectacular guys i was so happy to be there i was so happy that i did it for myself you know you know there are things that you owe to yourself to say you know what i'm gonna do this thing i am going to actually go and do it and come back and i'm so happy i still have my seat let me show you my sea water I still have my seawater still in here it's still in here i was told that you need to take the sand with so that it doesn't disappear but yeah my seawater is still sealed i'm using the other one i'm just i'm just drinking it because i don't know how else am i supposed to use it because i have a shower so it's either i drink it or i spray it on myself after the shower that's what i've been doing so far but guys i'm happy to be back and and let's hope for a, a prosperous um year and let's hope for a safe year and let's hope for a good year 
and thank you so much guys to everyone who's been subscribing to my channel everyone who has been supporting my channel and it wouldn't be what it is if you guys were not viewing the channel if you guys were not viewing the videos and subscribing if you haven't happened to subscribe to the channel please click i'm waiting click click on the subscription button below and click again to um have the bell ring whenever i upload a video anyway thank you so much to everyone who's been subscribed and let's have a happy new year and